So I had a video on a shopping cart trick and somebody responded with a comment saying, can I do this on my phone or do I need to use my desktop? So you're able to use your desktop. You're able to use a laptop. I got the approvals on both of those. And also I have my phone here because I want you to see that you can do it on your phone. Now I did the Victoria's Secret one just because, you know, it's the easiest one I always do just to show that you can do it. So look here, here's the pop up for Victoria's Secrets. Now, it has a person name at the top, and they let me be able to put the information in. I don't want to mess their name up or anything, so I got it kind of scrolled up. But it says, congratulations to that person. You've been pre-approved for the Victoria's Secret uh, MasterCard credit card. Oh, it's a MasterCard. Oh, my gosh. I just now realized it. Oh my gosh. So Victoria's Secrets got their MasterCard, which means you can use this credit card anywhere MasterCard is accepted. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I just found that out literally right now. But you can get this pop-up. So let me show you what you got to do. Let's do another screen. And I'm in incognito, um, quotation marks, um, private mode. So um, let's go to um, Victoria's Secrets. So Victoria's Secrets, I'm just going to type that in. They're going to take me to the website. I don't like to click on the ad. I don't want to make them pay. So let's see. Um, Let's see. So you want to put between $200 and $250 worth of items in the cart. So um, let's go ahead and find out what you want to put in there. Maybe we'll do just a pajama set. They're $21.99 right now. Let's click on that. So we got a pop-up so far saying stay in touch and in style. Put your email address in. Um, I don't think so. Not right now. So we can find a pajama set and we can get, we probably going to need to get about 10 of these. So let's get five of each. So we're going to get this one. Actually, it's a different color. So let's just pick one size. And actually, they don't even have it where you can put a certain amount in there. Let's just add a few things then. Let's just go on a crazy shopping spree. Add to bag. Perfect. Add to bag. Okay, let's just keep adding this because it seems like it's working, you all. Because I wanted to get it between 200 So we had $215. So between $200 and $250. So we had $215. So let's go ahead and click check out. Now these are all of the items. We want to check out as a guest. We do not want to um, put any information in. So let's continue to. Let's click on continue to check out. And then you want to put this information in. You want to put your first and last name in your address in with your city state and zip code your phone number and your email address now i did all of that already and that's how this approval came about because as soon as you um oh let me go back to click and see what it says once you click continue to delivery you're going to get that pop-up and the pop-up is going to be this pop-up right here. Congratulations. You pre-approved for a MasterCard. Oh, my gosh. This is still bugging me out, you guys. Oh, Y'all better go ahead and get it while they have it available. But you pre-approved for a MasterCard. And this would not work for everybody. It's called a shopping cart trick. It's not really a trick. It's just something you do. When you want to apply for credit cards, if they get a, give you a pop-up saying, hey, you pre-approved for a credit card, they targeted you. So you've been targeted go ahead you can use your phone i'm on an iphone right now you can use your phone you can use a desktop or you can use a laptop so go ahead and try it on out and a few people have been getting pre-approved for this i mean they've been getting approved for this they already got the pop-up with your pre-approved but they've been getting a credit card but they didn't tell me it was mastercard maybe right now it's just mastercard tell me if i'm just tripping i just not haven't i haven't been paying attention i don't know but i don't remember it being a mastercard i've been i've been remembering it that you got to go to victoria's secrets or go to pink and that's it or you can go to bath and body works but now it's a mastercard so i'm so excited about this oh my gosh but yes you can do the shopping cart trick with your phone
So don't forget, I have all of the steps for the shopping cart trick for the people that's like, wait, what's the shopping cart trick? I have all of the steps for the shopping cart trick on my website. And I also have a lot of videos. But when you go to my website, All Things Rakita, if you look at the top, you'll see a section called shopping cart trick. I don't know how long that section will be there. I think I'm, I'm thinking about moving it over to credit accounts. So if you come here and you don't see an, a, um, a section that's called shopping cart trick, look under credit accounts because that's where it will be. But if you go to this section, you'll see how somebody was able to get approved for a $3,000 visa card. So yeah, it's working you all. And I even have a guide to teach you how to do the shopping cart trick. And then it tells you about all of the credit cards where you can do the shopping cart trick at like all of the different websites so definitely check that out and if you want us to try the shopping cart trick for you you can click right here on this link that has a star but the steps for the shopping cart trick is first you got to opt in so you got to opt into these two websites that's how these companies are even going to know about you that's how they're going to know that you even want to get a credit card you even out to even get credit cards but opt in to factor trust and opt out pre-screen i say allow five to ten business days for your information being the system but if you're credit crazy like me call them their phone number is on their website call them every day hey is my information in the system your information may be in the system right now too if you ever did like a payday loan because this is basically a small credit bureau that's all it is it's a smaller credit bureau that keep our information and they furnish your report just like TransUnion, equifax and experian so call them, ask them if you're in the system. And if I were you, I would just call Factor Trust. I wouldn't worry about the opt-out pre-screen. Call Factor Trust for sure. Make sure information is in the system. And you can start right away, even if you opt into Factor Trust and the opt-out pre-screen, you can start right away to try to see if you can get the pop-up just like I showed you. So I just showed you the Victoria's Secret. How did I not see that on that picture? I just been so busy, you all. Because I got the MasterCard picture there. I put that there. But um yeah you all so that's the victoria's secret you can do the victoria's secret and we have the overstock you can do that somebody got approved four thousand dollars with the overstock the good sam visa um that's the camping world one i just showed you with the three thousand dollars you also have the lane Bry lane bryant credit card the express credit card children's place and it's so many more i told you all, i have my guy here that you all can get and you can just click right here you can get the guide right now so go ahead and get that guide if you want to know all of the different credit cards with the shopping cart trick but hopefully this help um, helps you all and if you have any questions definitely let me know but let me know right in the comments make sure you all subscribe because i'm only answering questions from the people that subscribe because I need to stay focused. It's so many um, comments I get and I need to make sure I answer people that's actually subscribed to me. If you took that time to press that subscribe button and like the video, I have no choice but to answer your question at least. I don't care how many people I get. Um, in my ecosystem people are watching my videos if you're not subscribed i'm not going to answer it so <laughs> that's going to be my commitment to you all so make sure you all subscribe and then i answer any questions but definitely come to my website all things for kids because i have so many different accounts here i even have a list of over 40 different credit cards that can pre-qualify you and i'm organizing this list too it's just the beginning of me building out this website so bad credit card bad credit okay if you have bad credit you're trying to figure out which credit cards to get go ahead and check out this list I have all the different accounts you can get with bad credit you want to do buy now pay later right now i just had a flights built um I have flights here, but I'm putting so many more things here. Check out that. You want to find out credit cards for your utilization? Go ahead and look at all these credit cards for when you maxed out your other credit cards. You need to get high limit credit cards. All these credit cards are going to give you high limit credit cards, and some can even pre-qualify you without a hard inquiry. You need to get a personal loan? I got y'all here. You can see right here all these different credit cards. It's for a personal loan, and all of them can pre-qualify you without a hard inquiry. And then also, we have all of these different credit cards that you all can look into getting. There's so many different credit cards here that you all can look into getting. But I'm going to go ahead and organize these. And you can see right here, like, look at the Wayfair. Pre-qualify, no credit check. Those are the ones you want to try. Two more credit cards. Pre-qualify, no credit check. Apple credit card. Pre-qualify, no credit check. So many different credit cards here, you all. But I hope that this is helpful to you all i'm putting this together just to make sure that everybody will know where to go and apply for these different credit cards so if you have any questions like i said drop them down in the comments i'll see you guys in the next video